I just finished my last haul video and it got to about 43 minutes. I said, okay, I've got to stop. But this is just a couple of uh, little things I got from Amazon. I believe. I'm trying to, I think I know it's in here. Yes. Because I saw these. Oh, see, I was looking for something else, too. This could come in a different way. Okay, so this is the art thing that I was waiting for. Uh, Arctic acrylic marker sets that I saw in Mira Byler. <laughs> She's such an influencer that I had to get these. Um, not that I need more acrylic markers, but they look really cool. And they're brush pens. I think that's why what tipped me over the edge. Because I do have acrylic markers. I've got a ton of Poscas and I've got some Artezas, but these are brush pens. So I've got two different sets. I mean, they had these for numbers, so. Is this a sticker? Maybe you can cut those. Out. Oh, they do come off. Okay, so you could put the little stickers on here. That's cool. Yeah, brush pens. So I think they're all different colors. Oh, this one didn't come with stickers. <laughs> Maybe it's underneath somewhere. I don't know. Oh, oh well. So let's give it a try. I don't have my lights on. It's right in the afternoon and the sun's streaming in, so perfect timing. Oh yeah, these are so juicy and nice. Yikes, I love these. Okay, I'm liking them. Yeah, so that's that. So 30 in each set. They were pretty reasonable. I'm trying to think of how much they were. 58, so the two sets together is about 48, a little under $48, so like $24 for a box of 30. So not bad. Hopefully I can use these in my uh, in my sketchbook challenge thing because they're nice and bright. All right, this is the other thing. I know it's just a book, but it's kind of, I'm hoping it will be helpful. Pop manga drawing. Because I just, I really like this style. But there there aren't too many books out there that kind of show you what to do. I'm not even sure if this is. Is this going to show me how to do it? Yeah. So, I love this. It's so cute. I just like that style. Because I have a couple, and they're all by the same woman. I've got, um, I think I've got two other books that kind of show what it is, but this hopefully will teach you more about drawing it, so. Okay, uh, I got an order from Dick Blick today. Um, I ordered a bunch of the, you know the, um, I got some free, free. <laughs> okay, in my, in one of the art snacks box that I got for the Valentine's thing, I got some thick um, Magnus uh, Faber-Castell colored pencils, watercolor pencils, and I wanted to order a couple more colors, and I don't even think I got half of what I ordered. I just, I don't know, and then, right, are these things I wanted? I think so. Okay. I'm opening, up. see, I ordered, <laughs> I got four. I think I ordered twice that many. Let me just see what I ordered. So I ordered one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I ordered, so I ordered eleven, and I got four. And then apparently the other ones are all in back order. I went on to uh, move, move. I don't know how to say it. Um, so I went on to Amazon and I ordered a set, and it was a set of. I don't know, six, maybe? Let me see. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. And, of course, one's a black and one's that green. And I think one might be this magenta, but the other ones, there's yellow, orange, red, and there's a, a blue. So at least I'll get a, um, and it was cheaper to get it in the set. The set was, the set comes with, um, a pit pen and a, a paintbrush 
and it was $17, and these were $4 a piece, so for four of them, that would cover the price of it. And I'm getting twice as that many pencils, plus I'm getting the extra two things. So, anyway, disappointing. I don't order from Blick a lot. I like, and I wish I could get the stuff from, um, from Jackson's, because I love Jackson's. But they don't have these. I didn't see them. And they, the other thing I ordered, I wanted to get a couple colors of this. And these are from France, so you would figure they would have them. They don't have them. They have, um, they have um, the shellac inks. But I, I like these better, so I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, I got these pencil eraser refills. These are for... Uh, let's see... it yeah it's uh, just an eraser stick and I want to get some refills I have a few of these that I got and in, in different um, like art snacks boxes and stuff and they, they're just the coolest things I love these erasers back in the old days we used to have to use uh, an eraser shield to get into little crooks and crevices and now they make these really cool eraser pens. <laughs> All right, so I have those, and I got this coloring book, mostly because I needed to spend enough money to get free shipping, and I didn't get, like I said, half the stuff I ordered. But this is um, Camilla Derrico, Derrico, I don't know how you say it. Um, I didn't get it for a coloring book, I got it because I just can't find enough of this style around. So, and she seems to be the only one who's putting any uh, books out about it. So, I just love this style. I just want to get into this. Oh, look at the hedgehog. Oh my God, that's so cute. Yeah, I love this. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I didn't get it for a coloring book. I got it as sort of a reference book. Look at that So, anyway, so I got these. So they were supposed to be, they were supposed to be on back order until yesterday. So I went on today and now they're back ordered until another two or three weeks. So, so we got, what colors are these? This is mauve, middle purple pink, uh, magenta, and leaf green. And then I have... So these are the two original ones that I got, which is black and phthalo green, dark phthalo green. So, I don't know, I'll get a couple more from Amazon. So basic colors, yellow, orange, um, red, which will be good. So I think that'll do me for a while. Not like I don't have colored pencils, I just really like these and I wanted to get the ones I wanted to get. I ordered, uh, so I ordered a uh, red, yellow, orange, um, ultramarine, cream, dark red, helio blue reddish. I'm not even sure what color that is, but it sounded interesting. <laughs> but I don't know. I guess we'll have to see if I can reorder them. By that time, um, maybe I'll order a few more of these colors. So anyway, that's it. For now. Okay. One more thing to add to the haul video. Um, I saw another YouTuber with one of these <laughs> recently and just became obsessed with getting one because it's, um, it's weird and it's <laughs> right up my alley and it looks kind of fun, but it was out of print. I think it's out of print. inside the box it's a little sketchbook and it's graph paper which I love and it's all different size graph paper although I did see her catching up and she said it was falling apart it looks like the binding isn't sticking too well but I'll be gentle with it <laughs> um, I just thought it'd be super fun I guess it was uh, published in 2017 maybe something like that I went to the website it's by Chronicles, Chronicle Books. I went to their website. They said out of print. I went to a bunch of different websites, out of print. Um, 
It looks like they sold it at Barnes & Noble, uh, but they didn't have any. So I went to eBay, of course. Is this the front or is this the front? This looks like, I don't, I guess this is the front. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't know, just thought it'd be kind of fun. I love the real tiny ones. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it, but it's just kind of fun. So there's that. Uh, it does say US and UK, so if you're in the UK, you might be able to find an old copy. They may have it on a clearance rack, maybe someplace. I don't know. All right, so that's that. Okay, and on to the next. All right, I have a package. Everything is art related, but I'll take out there's a couple things that are. Okay, that's quite small. I thought it was going to be. You want a box, Murph? Okay, um, I had some white paint die on me. It was just really stinky, so I ended up just getting this to replace it because I couldn't get anything else. I heard that this wasn't very good. I mean, it was cheap. I don't really care. I just wanted something basic for um, craft paint, so hopefully it'll be okay. And I got these because I thought that I could do maybe a fun little video. Oh, look, it comes with all this fun stuff. I didn't even think it came with this. I thought it was just the canvases. So, I don't know. I thought that'd be kind of fun to do something with and they're bigger than I thought they were so we'll see uh, I don't think I'm going to be using this paint though I do like these brushes <laughs> is this made of plastic yeah it is it's too bad be nice if it was made of uh ceramic all right so that's it for now uh package from Hobby Lobby About that can you see in there this is just I don't know I just thought this would be fun to paint like a little a little kitty portrait on you know a piece of wood kind of neat I got some this isn't really art supply but uh, white duct tape I got this weird little snake oh is it supposed to make that noise oh my that's really cool I actually got this from Murphy but you can paint it <laughs> it's so cute. Makes a weird noise, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna put that in bed tonight, see what Murphy does. <laughs> um, a wooden panel. I bought one of these a long time ago to paint on, and I ended up using it for <laughs> a stand to put my fan on in the in the bedroom. I put it over the top of my little trash can so that the fan was up, and so I've always left it there, and I haven't to use it. I ordered this sketchbook because I wasn't sure what it, it just looks really fun. It's uh, Bristol. Oh, it looks really nice. Really nice thick pages. And it's huge. 10 by 10. Uh, Master's Touch. I guess it, is that um, that Hobby Lobby brand? But it looks really nice. And 80 pages. So neat. Bristol's good. It'll take, um, really take ink and it'll take gouache. It'll take It'll take um, wet uh, media. I got two of these? I thought I only got one of these. I think I only got one of these, but anything, another kind of portraity thing. I thought I could do some kitty portraits on here. And this little mannequin. I got this little mannequin. <laughs> this is more for decoration. I, I've never really been successful at using one to draw from. Um, does he stick? Oh, he's magnetic. See, yeah, this is cool. I, ha I have one, uh, but it's a cat. Um, yeah, he's pretty cool. And he's got a little magnet so he can hold the ball. <laughs> That's fun. And he sticks, this is magnetic, so he can stick to that. Well, it might be kind of interesting to use for reference, so yeah. So that is my little haul. I don't think I ordered two of those, but I must have. 
And I'll have to let you know how Murphy likes the snake. He's sleeping right now. I don't think I'm going to paint it. I think I'll just leave him. He's cute. All right. Till next time. Yeah, Murphy definitely likes the snake. <laughs> he slobbered over it a little already. It's really fun. <laughs> um, and just another note on this. Oh, there goes my little guy. And the ball. <laughs> um... Glad I got it from Murphy did. I was going to say that this Bristol. Get on there and stop falling over. I just want to mention that Bristol, you can also do oil painting if you wanted to, um, you know, not have to, if you want to practice and not use a canvas. I would recommend just doing one side because the oil will leak through on the other side, but it's thick enough for oil, for oil paint. I did, um, I've got a couple of um, wire bound sketchbooks that I've used that for. So. Yeah. yeah, I really like this. Surprising. Okay. <clears throat> I've got a couple of things from Amazon. bargain. This one, eh, comparatively, it was a bargain. <laughs> um, I got some of the abstract acrylic ink, which I have several bottles of. I just don't, I mean, I didn't have all the colors. I don't even think I have any of these. I got it specifically because I wanted, because I wanted white and black. Um, so those two came in the pack. And I don't think, is this primary red? I think they're just all primaries, right? Primary yellow, primary blue. Yeah, so I don't think I have these, but I'll just add to my collection. But I was working with this ink, desperately looking for black. These are the same pencils as, as the pencils that I got in the, in the snack, Arts Next box. I got those two, and I think this is the same one. Oh God, I think this is the same one too. I got these four from um, Blick, and it's, so these three are the same. I don't, think, I don't know how to get them out of here. Oh, okay. But these are new, and I think they were charging like three ninety nine. So one, two, three, four, five times four is 20. And this was 16 or 17, 16.99. So it was cheaper to get these. I, and uh, Blick was out of, out of stock and I couldn't find them anyplace else. So anyway, so I've got extra ones. The, I don't mind having extra black. I don't mind having extra of the magenta either because I like that color. The green, on the other hand, another story. Comes with a brush, which is kind of cool. 10 round and a pit pen, fine liner. Oh, it's real tiny. It's a uh, 0.3. So that's good. I'll use all of those. And I like the tin, so I'll find something to put in here. Oh, I think I can just take this paper off. And I have a nice little tin to put things in. Maybe I can just keep the pencils in there because <clears throat> I'm keeping them in a like a little jar. Because yeah. I do, there are a couple of the colors I wanted to add to this, but this is good for now. I've got pretty much what I need. Wouldn't mind if they have a white. I wouldn't mind getting a white. But so that's it. And that was from Amazon. This set was like $23, maybe $24. I'm not sure. Which is still good because they sell, let me think, they sell them for about six bucks. So six hundred five is 30. So even if they were five, it would still be good. So, okay. I just got one thing today. I got it from Art Snacks. Uh, it was related to one of the 
uh, Valentine mystery boxes that I got. Put it. Okay. I right, just got four of the um, pencils. Those uh, Magnus, the big fat watercolor pencils. <laughs> I got a uh, geranium lake, pale geranium lake, uh, ochre, burnt ochre, deep scarlet red, and cream. Um, because you just can't find these anymore. I ordered some from Blick, and I got, I think I got four. And then I looked, and all the rest were on back order. I'm like, all right, so I'll wait for them. And then I think I had seven on back order, and five of those are now out of print. They're not making them anymore. Uh, and then I found, <laughs> I went to a couple other places, so you'll see um, me opening a couple more. I did get a couple on Amazon, but apparently I found them just in the nick of time of them going out of stock. I don't know why, because uh, they're really cool. But anyway, so I got these four to add to the little collection. I had them in the tin, but I moved some other stuff around, so I put them in here. <laughs> um, so those are the ones I have. I'm going to add a couple more. I ordered, um, I still maybe have um, some coming from Blick. I think I have two coming from Blick, possibly, if they don't go out of stock by that time. Um, and then I found a couple on eBay. So anyway, so that's that for now. You'll be seeing an update once I get the eBay package. It's coming from Australia, so I don't know when I'll get to update that, but that's that. Just one little thing from Amazon. I got some black gouache. Um, as I, I decided I'm on a mission to use up all my Liquitex gouache. which comes in these annoying containers. Um, so I put them in here. I had an empty spot and I put, I wanted to put black in, but um, I didn't have any. I didn't have any in the Liquitex. So I looked, I said, I'll, I have some in a tube, I'm sure. And I only had one skinny little container of black. So I decided I needed some because I do have, on top of this, I do have <laughs> um, several tubes of um, the Holbein acrylic wash. So I figured I could use this in here, which I did. I put the black in here, <clears throat> but it's like I said, it's a little skinny too. So um, anyway, that'll be a good replacement. I should probably get some white, but I don't need it right away. So I have that now and I'll see you with some more stuff later. <laughs> I opened the whole package and I forgot I should have filmed it. <laughs> so yeah, let me put a light on for you. came from Australia. I was expecting something else. So I was a little confused when the package came, but somebody in Australia had some of those pencils that I've been looking for. So I got some of the colors that I was unable to get anyplace else, and I got a notice from Blick that none of the pencils I ordered from them will be in stock. They're all discontinued. So this is my last resort. Oh, dark red. <laughs> dark red, dark chrome yellow, <clears throat> indigo, dark indigo, I got earth green, yellowish, white, and helio blue reddish. So that's about it as far as the collection's going. So I have those. Um, I got a black, I got a white, I've got a couple of blues, a couple of yellows, orange, I got a few reds, greens, a couple of magentas. So that should be good. I really like these pencils, so yeah. So that's my little collection. Those are the Faber Castell Albert Durer Magnus big watercolor pencils. All right.